Most people believe in my experience that if you have automatic updates turned on with Windows, uh, all the Windows updates will come in automatically. But that is not uh, strictly true. There are times when updates are held back or simply will not come in until you manually push them forward. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to check for that. Let's click on Start and we'll go to the Settings icon. Go to Update and Security. And here we can see the kind of situation that I'm talking about where we have an optional update available. Right? It's not going to come on, it on in on its own, um, at least not immediately. It might sit here for months before it decides to come in. Uh, and you have the option to manually decide to download and install it. And what I have found in recent weeks, uh, servicing computers, is that certain clients have called me up and said uh, their machines were terribly unstable, strange things were happening, and that if I went in, uh, I discovered and downloaded and installed uh, these optional updates, their problems were solved. Nothing else uh, was required. They didn't have any malware, etc. Uh, their system was just in an unstable state that was solved by these updates. So my recommendation in general would be to go ahead, uh, if you're having issues, and download and install these kinds of updates. Now, if you're not having issues and your computer is very stable, uh, you may want to wait and, and let it take its time to come in, uh, which gives Microsoft more time to work out some of the kinks. And when you do get the update, uh, you may be getting an, a more stable and updated version of it. Right? But uh, if you have any reason to uh, jump in and try and uh, bring your computer up to speed and force all updates to come through, go in manually and check for updates. And another key piece of advice I would give you is that if you go in uh, after rebooting and it says you're up to date, don't believe it. Click check for updates just to make sure because very often it will say it's up to date, but if you check for updates, it'll find several more, right? So uh, keep going in until you click on check for updates and it still says you have no updates. Then you can be confident that you've got everything that you need.